What's up guys, it's Raf in the Raf Cave and welcome back to another video. Uh, this is a kind of not a really an unboxing, more just a PSA announcement or a, a something to help you guys out if you have any issues with uh, your gaming headset not working in the with the Xbox One Elite controller. So I picked up Turtle Beach. This is the uh, Headset Audio Controller Plus. And this little guy here is really neat. It's a, it's a headset adapter that can go into your controller, which gives you a lot of cool features. So basically you have your game and chat volume mixer, which is nice because sometimes you want to hear your friends louder than the game, and sometimes you want the game louder than your friends talking. So that's a nice way to have a, a quick access uh, uh, volume control on your thumb here. Also, the quick access to your volume. So a lot of times you have the volume control on your headset, headsets. you got to fumble around with it and kind of reach around. Or you got some kind of a, a thing on your neck with the volume rocker. No, no, no. This is on your controller. So basically, you just put your thumb down and do the volume quickly, which is awesome. Uh, another thing with this one, you're going to be able to modify the sound. You're going to get game presets. Uh, so I believe they have, uh, let's see, they have like a super hearing one. You have uh, all bass one. You have a more of a natural sound. There's like four different sounds that you can uh, uh, shift between or select between them, which is really neat. But also you have mic presets, which is really cool about that. It kind of acts as a, it's a, like a, a mic uh, limiter or a, um, basically what it, what it does. There's three different settings. There's a small room, medium room, large room setting. So say if you're in a like a quiet room, you would keep it in small room because what what it's going to do is allow your microphone to capture more more noises, more sounds around you. So that way, um, you know, you can talk quieter, you know, and it'll hear you. Uh, medium sized room is if you have some noise in the background that basically shrinks the the microphone volume or the capture a little bit. So it basically just captures more around you. And then if you have a louder room, you go into the um, the big room setting or a large room setting and that way it brings the microphone capture down to a smaller diameter diameter so that when you're speaking it hears your voice and not picking up all the outside uh, noise around you which is really cool so that's really neat but the point of this video is is I have the brand new HyperX cloud orbit S's absolutely awesome headphones guys check out my video on this Unboxing and setup review, magnetic drivers, which is a pretty incredible about this headset. Can't really see it. There you go. There you go. Boom. Magnetic drivers, not the uh, standard cone drivers. These are 100 millimeter headphones. They sound brilliant. But the problem is when I plug it into my Elite controller, I get no sound. No sound, no mic, no nothing. So I'm going to show you guys uh, that it's not working on the Xbox here in a minute. And then I'm going to show you that it works with the standard controller. I plug it in here, works just fine. But you buy the Elite for a reason. It's got a much better controller, feels better, response is better. Tons of features, that's why this is better. So without further ado, guys, I'm going to uh, show you the on and off difference with this and that. And then the red controller, then you're going to see that it works with this. All right, guys, be right back. All right, guys, welcome back. So now I have the headsets on, the uh, power button. The uh, power button's on. The headsets are turned on. I got the mute off. Got it plugged into my Elite controller. So as I'm moving around the menus, and the volume is all the way up, by the way, all the way up. Uh, as I'm moving on the menus, I don't hear any kind of click, 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 or you know that little sound it makes. So there's nothing. Uh, if I go to my party, so I made a party. And I'm speaking now, so it's got my the red light, the yellow, the white light. So it says it's picking up something. Uh, so if you go to chats, and I'm just sending a message to Mohawk dude here. Record. Testing, testing, one, two, three. So it captured my voice there. Play. I only hear it in my left, left ear cup headset. And then this is pushed in all the way. And this is pushed in all the way, but it only comes on the left. So 
there's no menu sound, but it does pick up the mic, but only plays back in the left, left ear. That's it. All right, so we'll back out of here. Turn off the controller. Unplug. Standard controller. Push it in. Turn that guy on. Okay, here's some clicks. Now I hear the menu. Click, 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 click. I go to my party. Hello, hello. It captures my voice fine there. Then I go to chats. Record another message. Testing, testing, one, two, three. Play it. Both ears and louder too. So something up with the Elite Controller. Now, let's try the Turtle Beach adapter. So basically just plug it in at the bottom. Right. Click. Headphone in the bottom. Turn it on. Okay, click is there. And I have to record something. Testing, testing, one, two, three. I hear it in both ears, and there's less metallic sound with my voice. It's a clearer voice. So we back out again, go to my party here, and of course it's reacting fine, but I'm getting the menu. So that's what's really huge. So guys, that's the trick. If you have the Elite Controller and you plug your headphone headset in, which would be like Razer heads, like Razer Nari Ultimates didn't work. The HyperX Cloud Orbit S didn't, didn't work well. So you get this guy, Turtle Beach headset audio controller. Then you have all these fine controls here. With... All right, guys, real quick. Um, just wanted to show you what the buttons are again. Remember this top one right here is your superhero heming soup. <laughs> the top one is your super footsteps hearing mode. Super footsteps. What is it called? Super human hearing. That's how you enable that. Uh, the bottom one is your mute. And of course your game chat uh, balance and your volume balance. Um, and then the game, the game presets. Uh, the first option is natural sound. This is like a neutral sound. Uh, the second one is the bass boost. If you want more bass. The third one is bass and treble boost. And then the fourth one is your voice enhancer. So those are the different game presets. You just kind of play with them and uh, see what sounds best for your game and your situation. Otherwise, uh, yeah, that's what those are for. All right, guys. Back to the video. The mute right there. The uh, the, uh, the you know the different audio settings. And then on the bottom, you get your game preset and your mic preset as well. And everything works just fine. Yep, full volume there. Yep, then I have my volume right here. I got my game chat balance right there. Everything is at my fingertips. It's perfect. I don't have to go like this with the control. I don't have to go like this and figure it out. It's just quickly boom, boom, boom. It's fantastic. All right, guys. Hopefully this helped you out. If you guys have... This headset or the Nari Ultimate, it doesn't work with the Elite. You know what to get, guys. This guy right here, I'll put a link in the description if you want to pick yourself up one. But I think it makes it sound even better through your headphones, so it's a nice way to upgrade your headset. All right, guys, thanks for watching this. Uh, un not really an unboxing, but just a helpful uh, 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 you know, tip and help you out if you need any help. So, Otherwise, guys, you enjoy gaming. Like, subscribe, share. Appreciate it. this helped you out. Comment below if this helped you out or if you have one. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Home Theater Rules. Wrath out. See ya.